it's about two weeks post DC Capital Grand Prix where I weighed in at 192 pounds. And um, I wouldn't really call this an off season. Let's fix this fucking camera angle. I call this pretty much the lifestyle that I'm leading now. I'm sitting probably about 196 to 198 pounds. It fluctuates depending on how much I've eaten throughout the day. And my diet has changed now. Now I'm thinking long term as far as how am I going to be able to sustain this for, well, fucking forever. I don't want to go off. I don't want to get fat again. I want to stay as this lean, as lean as I am right now, year round. So that I'm only literally like a few pounds away from my contest weight. So the idea is I'm not going to eat the same foods all the time. So I actually hired a uh, meal prep service called Nutrition Solutions. So this is the first time I've actually hired a, um, someone to actually cook my food for me. And um, they sent me, so every week, the menu changes. So this week... Um, yeah, we can do this for fucking meal one. Why not? Who gives a shit, right? We're adults. We can do whatever the fuck we want, right? So meal one today is, let's hold this up so you can see this. Chicken barbecue pizza. Okay, there's the macro count on it. And they ship them to me in these nice little turbo containers. And that's what the pizza looks like. Now, some people are going to oh, Jerry, it's just one slice of pizza. Well, I don't want to stuff myself full of fucking food. Like, I'm just not into that anymore. I eat this. I have a whole thing of water with it. I'm good for a couple hours. Like, that's all I need. I eat when I'm hungry. So with that, I think what I'm going to do is actually you know, mix up a shake with it. Bring my protein up a little bit. Because that's got 30-something grams of protein in it. So I'll put 20-something more. So about 25 more grams of protein in that. Bring the protein count up to 50-something. Uh, I'm not really paying too much attention to my macros, but... I definitely need them in a certain range to be able to maintain or even gain mass at this time. So the idea is to not really gain a whole lot more mass, but put on another five pounds slowly over the next six to eight months and maintain my waist as small as it is now so that when I step on stage, I'll be even bigger and fuller and more dense with the same size waist, which was in constant shape. It was 28 and a half. Which is a few weeks ago, I can guarantee you it's not that now because I'm eating more food. I haven't measured it, but I can guarantee you it's, it's not that anymore. So, my pants are still fitting, you know, a little loose, so that's, that's good. Sorry, right, so we'll mix that up in the barbecue pizza. Pizza for breakfast, because why the fuck not, right? We're adults, we can do whatever we want. Nobody's the boss of us, right? That's a good breakfast. All right, we'll hit you up with the second meal, which is the same but different in a little while. I'll be here before a gym meal. Hey, we done. You get up and have another meal? Are you like you don't care? What's your ear doing? What's your ear? Okay. We had a little bulldog emergency about a half hour ago. I looked, heard Bruno like scratching and stuff. What the fuck are we watching? That's well, Predator. <laughs> Bruno's scratching and I turn around to look and his ear is full of blood. So he has like this ear infection that um, it's not going to clear up. He's on antibiotics. He's on a strong antibiotic twice a day. It's not going to clear up. So basically it like oozes and, and I think it aggravates. Oh, you up now? You up moving around now? Yeah. You heard food, huh? <laughs> All right. So, you know, basically I had to clean his ear and he fucking hates it. Like, he just completely flopped on his side like a fucking, like a whale or a dead fish or something. Here he comes. So now it's time for the next meal of the day. Um, this one, it's kind of similar to what I was doing before. Maybe a little, slightly different, and I'll tell you what's different about it, okay? So, hey, bro. How you doing, buddy? You want to be on camera now that you're up and about here? Oh, what are you doing? Oh, want to come say hi? Hi. Yeah, all right. <laughs> he loves food. You going to eat too? You already eat this morning some? All right. So basically, I'm going to have oatmeal again, which I love oatmeal. I've mentioned that like several times already. Every time I have oatmeal. Two packets of oatmeal, which carb-wise is about the same as what I was taking in when I was regaining for the, uh, the DC Capital Grand Prix. And the only real difference that I'm making right now in this pre-workout meal, it's not pre-workout, it's about 90 minutes before my workout, is now I'm having a 
having this. Muscle Egg. Okay, I am not sponsored by Muscle Egg. I am not an affiliate. I don't have a discount code, so don't ask me for it. My buddy Zane hooked me up um, at the show. Thank you, Zane, very much. And it's a cake batter egg white. How fucking awesome is that? Seriously. Like straight up, cake batter egg whites. So basically, you get your egg whites, but it tastes like cake batter. When you mix that with the oatmeal itself, do you already have apple um, oatmeal? I don't know why this can have a fucking film on it. I haven't used it in like two days. And like and the cake batter mixes well with the, uh, the apple oatmeal, like really, really well. And what I do with the oatmeal is, so I'm not dieting anymore for the show. When I do a show, I cut out, well, to a certain point, I cut out all sweeteners. Here's something that people don't know, and it's a secret. It's one of the things that I was taught by NIFBB Pro a while ago. And that is when you're drying out for a contest, people that are drinking Crystal Light, you're not going to dry out like someone who's drinking regular water. The reason being is aspartame, sucralose, all that stuff, Splenda, actually causes inflammation in the body, whether you know it or not. Inflammation or an inflammatory response is going to cause water retention. Even if it's slight water retention, it's still water retention. And if you have water retention the day of the show, guess what? You're going to get fucking your ass kicked by someone who doesn't have water retention on the day of the show, who did the right. So stuff like creatine, sweeteners, um, protein powders, because those have sweeteners in them too. I used to have protein powders on my shoulder right up to the show. Well, guess what? You know, I didn't start drying out fully and looking a hell of a lot harder until I cut that shit out. So, all that stuff I'll cut out, you know, beforehand. But since I'm not getting ready for a show, cinnamon, and I use, um, it's like the, uh, the giant brand of sweetener. So, it's basically equal. So, a packet equal and cinnamon inside that with the egg batter or the cake batter egg whites is just fucking amazing. Right, buddy? Are you eating? I love watching them eat. It's so funny. Watch. Come here, buddy. You eating? Nom, 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 nom. Nom, 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 nom. You love the camera now, huh? Okay. We're not loving that camera. All right, let's eat, buddy. We're post workout now. I did shoulders and arms today. I actually had a really good workout. I got a fucking sick pump. I know I'm about to train Katie right now. And before Katie, I'll drink my shake. So my shake is the same shake that I've been doing, which is um, 40 grams, which comes out to like 30. Is it 40 grams? Yeah, 40 grams comes out to 30 grams of carbs from real food and a scoop and a half of banana MTS whey. And then um, after I train Katie, I'll train her husband, Brooks. And then after Brooks, I'll have my next meal, which I get everything packed up in my my handy dandy turbo custom made <laughs> ISO bag. So let's uh, get the training and then we'll hook some shit up later. All right, next meal up is um, from Nutrition Solutions. This is the, uh, the Chimmy chimichurri skirt steak. I think that's how you say it. Um, 396 calories, 8 grams of fat, 40 grams of carbs, 41 grams of protein. So this one's a little heavier with the protein, which I'm fine with for now. And then I got a couple errands to run. Not with Aaron, but a couple errands to run. <laughs> and then um, I'll head home and I'll have, I think I'm gonna have chicken and um, chicken and Ezekiel bread tonight for like one of my chicken wraps I think I'll have when I get home. We'll see. Maybe I'll have, I don't know, maybe I'll have something else when I get home. So this is meal number four or five. This is meal number five. Yeah, number five. All right, guys, we're on meal number six. And meal number six now is, again, more food than what I was taking in. Well, fuck, of course it's more food than I was taking in when I was dieting. Yeah, of course. Anyway, so two burrito wraps, which are my chicken burrito wraps from um, Whole Foods with... The blue cheese is from Walden Farms, and I got the Flavor God flavorings on there. Four slices of Ezekiel toast with um, sugar-free jelly on them, and I got that Buff Bake shit on there, too. And here's my phone over here. Say hi, Aaron. Hi. Yeah, Aaron's on the phone, so we're going to eat and fucking chill now. And then later on, I think I'll probably have a Quest Bar, and I might have, um, I think maybe I got, like, one more chicken breast in there. I might eat that before I go to bed. Right, we'll see whatever. So, anyways, this is the stuff that's been going on since... I'm not going to be competing anymore for the rest of the year. So I got to say, you know, thank you to Nutrition Solutions. I, like I said, I am not sponsored by them. I do pay for my food from them. You know, it's a legit company that, you know, who the fuck doesn't want to eat pizza and, you know, shit like that? I mean, it's not your regular meal prep company. So check them out. I think it's nutritionsolutions.net. Or you can get them on Instagram at Nutrition Solutions. Or Chris Cavallini, you can hit him up on 
um, Instagram too. So for now, I'm going to eat and then talk to Aaron for a little while because, you know, what the fuck, that's what you do, right? At the end of the day, you talk to <laughs> I hear you laughing on the phone over there. All right. <laughs> I'm BioSU and I approve this message and we're out.